That's Apache. She's not very happy with me. Hi, how are you? <laughs> so, I am on a logging trail somewhere in the Olympic Peninsula. Sometimes the road has asphalt, and most of the time it doesn't, and it's gravel. And I even had to stop and move a big ass log out of the road. I'm not where I belong. I have seen zero other people or vehicles. The sign back there, way back there, said that there was a campground up here. And I followed it, and it said in, you know, like 2.3 miles. So I'm like, okay, that'll be 107.6 miles on my truck. I saw the sign, but there was a fork in the road, and one was gravelly downhill and narrow, and one was gravelly up hill and a little bit wider. So I took the wider road. Apparently that was not the right road. I look like I have a black eye. What the hell's wrong with me? Huh. It's weird. Anyway, I'm lost. I only have 97 um, gallons of gas left. Come on, baby. Come on. I am so tired. <laughs> um, say hi. Hi. Yes, such a good girl. The clock is Idaho time. Uh, Nampa, Idaho time. I'm so tired. So, I'm going to sleep. I ate lunch and it's just sitting like a rock in the bottom of my stomach. I did manage to get turned around. Um, when I drove to this spot, um, there was evidence of a campfire um, long ago. So I thought, okay, someone else has been here once and I am too. So I turned around so that I'm going back down. So I have no idea how much further that direction the road will take me. Well, actually, it's this direction because it's all twisty turnies. My GPS on my truck has no idea. My phone says no service. I'm very tired. Um, it's comfortable outside. There's like no insects. Just a couple of birds. It's really weird. It's quiet. So quiet. So I'll open a couple of windows and I'll take a nap. And then I'll get up and have dinner and I'll go back to bed. And maybe tomorrow I can move on. If not, I'll just sleep all day again. And I've done that many, many times and that's how tired I am. I think I'll just sleep get up to let the dog out and to pee and more sleep so wherever you are whatever you're doing i hope you're safe i hope somebody else knows where you are because nobody knows where i am even though um i have life 360 which is an app that tells other people where i am i highly doubt that if i sent out an sos anyone would be able to find me because i don't know where the fuck i am I'm in the Olympic Forest, on the Olympic, Olympic Peninsula, way up in the mountains on the logging trail. Okay, well, if nothing else, this has been an adventure, and I have no regrets. Okay, well, I would have liked to make it to my reunion, but <laughs> that's still possible. I still have a few days. I can do that. It's just so quiet and it's so eerie and there's no animals and there's miles of hillside of no trees, no life, just a few logs and down trees and tree roots and, and things that are the bad side effect of logging. I think if it weren't so remote, they could probably hire people that don't have jobs to come up here and clean it up. Like Job Corps, that'd be a great job for Job Corps or the Army. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, it's just so quiet and so desolate. Let's see if I can share that with you. That's my view out my door. It's awful pretty. <laughs> <laughs>